Thank you for coming back to Polka Dot Mailbox, and if you're new, welcome. Today I'm working with the Lemon Bright Cute Cut Craft Kit. Cute Cut Craft is on Etsy, and what I do ahead of time is I plan out what kit I'm going to use for the week, and I put a little sticky note when I order it. So I also did some pre-planning here. I actually cut out the full boxes. So I'm just using one single sheet of full boxes. They're only $3 and it's a really good deal. I've printed some pictures and I've laid out what I'm going to do. I've already put my little journaling in to save some time. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put it all together and show you what it looks like. So it was really tough. The theme of the week I've been choosing based upon the colors that come in the Erin Condren vertical. And it's really tough because <laughs> everything about this like color and all the kits are very spring themed because we are entering upon nicer weather. But <laughs> this is the kind of weather we're dealing with here where I live. It was an absolute snowstorm on Thursday and uh, it was very pretty and it was really quite fun walking around. I actually didn't mind it at all. Oh, I've done something wrong. Oh, that goes. Oh. I get busy talking and I realized I had wanted this sticker to go here. Um, anyways, the, uh, the weather was really quite mild. Be anytime it snows, it's not super cold. So it was quite enjoyable to be walking around in the, uh, the cold weather, but it was actually quite hard to see because the, um, snow it was just it was like a blizzard it was really blowing so anyways this just gives you a little example of how i do my memory keeping in my erin condren vertical life planner with just one set of full box stick stickers and some pictures that i print out on my canon selfie um, another thing that I wanted to highlight this week is the week of videos for my YouTube channel was really um, dedicated to unboxings. So I got um, the Valentine's Day grab bags. I was not planning on getting the grab bags this year. They didn't come out before the Scrap for Heart, which was the primary motivation for buying them last year was that I could um, use them for donations and little prizes and things. But I got a text from my girlfriend saying that they were there. They only had three in because they got rid of most of their Valentine stuff. And I can link the video for you here so that you can see the uh, unboxing of what came in my Valentine grab bags, but it was really <laughs> quite funny that um, that she texted me and I wasn't going to get them, but I just happened to be close by and on my lunch hour when the message came in, so I decided, okay, I will run over and get some. And uh, yeah, they were quite cute, so I was glad that I picked those up and it's not a ridiculous amount of stuff like the one time I had a huge grab bag haul from Christmas last year that took up like one of our entire storage rooms for the year so here's the picture I actually wanted to take a nice picture or video outside I took this one in my car just because it was so windy that I don't even think I could have got a picture it was uh it was crazy and then there's quite a contrast between that day and this day and there was quite a contrast even in the weather of the week so my fabfitfun box came in and i can link that video for you here as well it is the spring 2020 box and i got two boxes and this is a picture of everything that was inside 
I really liked all of the um, products. It was really a fun highlight of the day. I did come home at lunch and do an unboxing video. So I thought I would make note of that in my planner. So that is how all of this is gonna come together. So I'm not gonna to add too much more to this. I did want to note, um, I have this sticker set from uh, Sweet Kawaii Design and it is from Michaels. I just wanted to note that our past coworker came and met us for coffee. So I thought I would put that little note on here. I wanted to have a cute little coffee. I just smudged my pen. I should have let that dry better. Maybe I could just do the remember. Kind of a cute little thing there. And I thought I might come in Go with the well friendship. Let's put that one. My squeaky chair. Okay, let's put this friendship. Little rub on on here. there and I actually like this saying live every moment laugh every day love beyond words it's a cute little saying and I was really enjoying the snow this day here so I think I'm going to split this. Just have live every moment, laugh every day beyond words. So that's cute. I like the way that's going to look. Okay, so just going to come in with the rub ons. So this is the first time that I've actually cut apart one of the full box sheets and pre-planned where everything was going to go. And honestly, I'm not even sure that I really needed to because I just placed everything down and then that was it. I never moved it. So oops, I just messed that up. Um, I never moved it and uh, so I didn't really need to cut them apart because I put them in their original spot right from the get-go. So this is a good lesson. Definitely need to be careful with this. But we will make it work. So I seem to have wrecked the Y, but we can easily come in. And fix that up. And just like this one here. There. Can't even really tell. Okay, how does this one look? Does this one peel off okay? Oh, I can't get this off there. Okay, it's not completely. There we go. So, word to the wise then, when you're doing rub-ons, <laughs> be careful, I guess to go up and down. They're so hard to. This is not in there. I don't know why 
which is so hard to uh, get this little part up here. Yeah, good. There. And then that's the finished product. So that is really simple. Really enjoying this way of memory keeping. If you're interested in ordering any of these stickers, you can visit the Etsy shop. This is based out of Canada, Cute Cut Craft. Very inexpensive and quick shipping. And for just $3, I've created this whole page. You can get full entire kits. She does have entire kits. If you're interested in seeing a whole flip through, you can look on my Instagram account and see the uh, flip through of the entire book so far. This is just sort of like a quick little look at everything I've done here. But if you're following Polka Dot Mailbox on Instagram, you can see all that there too. So I thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again next time.